Hey you guys, it's Brandon from I Like Scary and we're finna do a 2022 Homer tour, you guys. So yeah, you guys, man. I know it's bro, you guys, it's been so long since I did a horror tour. I'm so excited. Uh so yeah, you guys, last time I did was when I first started doing YouTube and um I told you guys, I promised you guys I would do a horror tour. You guys have been asking for so long. So you guys, I'm gonna give you guys a great horror tour, man. You guys definitely deserve it. We have a lot to talk about in this video. So you guys, we're finna get started. You guys are finna see the journey of I Like Scary and just the growth of this collection, man. I appreciate you guys. I couldn't do none of this without you guys. Remember that I Like Scary. And um, yeah, we're finna get started, you guys. So first off, you guys, when you come in the room, I have Mr. Jack Torrance, Red Rum, of course. Everyone's a fan of The Shining. Um, I know I am. But uh, and then we have a original '78 Halloween poster, super sweet. Up here we have a Welcome to Handfield sign, which I got from um, Spirit. Had to get that super sick. Uh, got this mask from Spirit, I want to say. Vacuum Myers mask. I think that was nice how I have 78 clown mask with the 78 type of Myers mask. They say it's a Halloween 2 mask, but it looks like a 78. Down here, we have a Byron Winston like movie theater picture with all the horror villains. I love Byron's work, man. I had to get this. I had got this at a convention days of the dead to be exact. And I thought this was cool. It's a Halloween um like door handle thing, whatever. It it can be anything. Door, I just put it on my door handle because I think it looks nice for the horror room. And it's all about detail with me. Room 237. Next to the shining. And you guys, all right, it's getting crazy. So above the door, um, I forgot this guy's name, but he has some nice ass horror prints. I got these when I first hopped in the horror community. Super sick, had to put them above the door. And um, so I got all like my autograph and phot uh, photo ops across the wall. So you're gonna see these during the video, but this is Evil Ed from Fright Night. I met him super cool. This is Alex Vincent from Child's Play. Andy, of course. Super cool. Nice to meet him. Um, this is one of my first autographs I've ever gotten, you guys, from Horham. My first con ever. And it was none other than Valak Bonnie Aarons. And she actually messed up. I will never forget that. She sat with her red and decided it wasn't going to show up and said, you know what? gonna go with white she did that and this is Chris Duran from H2O I actually got this from a collector store since they know I come in there and I love Michael Myers she actually gave me this for free because she said she wouldn't have any use for it so thank you um this is a Halloween kills movie kind of like mini movie poster I got from a con um super nice got that right there and um this is the um, Trick or Treat Studios um, H40 Gunshot Wound Mask, which is not accurate to the film because they made it too big. This is Pennywise in the gutter, which I got from Monica's uncle. He gifted it to me. Thought that was a little creepy piece to put. Like It's like he's staring from the bottom. <laughs> Have that puck like shining on that. This is another Byron Winton's art. These are just like two a two-piece set. They're like little stock art cards, but uh, I got a frame customized for it. I put the leaves in there. As you see, 2018 Lori and Michael, 78 Lori and Michael, super cool. Love this, I got this from a con. Uh, my first con, actually, got this from the same con as this. Myers fan, of course, had to grab that. This is my guy, Steven LaRose. Um, you can see him on Instagram, man. Once you see his work, you know who he is. Love this, man. Kind of sucked that I didn't get the 2018 Myers one in a 78. But the moment I learned and found out about him, I've been having his art in my collection ever since. My guy, 
Mr. Leprechaun himself. Um, super creepy. I put this together. The whole life size. This mask is by Monster Man. The guy is super talented. Got that for Christmas and I had no choice but to make him a life size. It was only right. Then I have like this horror pillow down there. It got all the villains and stuff. If you can see it, I don't want to move it. Uh, got that from like a flea market, I want to say. By the way, I redid the horror room. So this poster used to be over this way, but we'll get to that later. Uh, had to have a poster of Daniel Harris. I love Daniel Harris. Um, Halloween 5. Um, this is, I wish this was like a 4, because I like 4 better than 5. But um, this was just the one that she was on. So, but got that. Probably a change that soon if I find a better a better Daniel Harris and Myers poster. Sorry Jack, Chucky's back. Uh got this movie poster, super nice and has to have All right, fact. I do not like this mask. It was just the mask that I wore to my son's gender reveal. I'm like I'm not going to throw it away, so why not keep it on top of the Trick or Treat Studios good guy box. I think that's a nice little touch you guys. <laughs> You have to have a good guy in your collection. That is a fact, you guys. And, one moment, you guys. All right, good guy. And my favorite TV show of all time, of course, Stranger Things. Have to have something Stranger Things in the collection. I feel like I'm cheating. But, I forgot to show you guys this. It's another print from that guy I was telling you about. His prints is so nice. This is a voodoo knife I got from Spirit. Just a nice touch. Um, I really love that man. But down here, Jennifer Tilly actually gave me that for free. She mailed it to me. I know you guys remember when she was mailing out free autographs. I was one of the lucky ones to grab that. So that was so sick. Another one of those art prints. Um, I, I want to know this guy's name. I want to say it's like John, man, but I don't want to say the wrong name. I just know he. I was d dealing with him for a long time, man. This is a metal sign that I got from one of you guys, a big supporter of the channel, of course, big fan of the channel. Um, my guy, Shape of the Shadows, gifted me this. I told him I would put it up in the collection. Shaping the shadows, it made it on the wall. I love this. Thanks again, appreciate it. Uh, Halloween '78 mini movie poster. Uh, this is like a little Chucky plaque thing I got from Spirit. Thought that was a nice little, you know, touch. Once again, Byron Wenton's art in the collection. This is one of my first that I got from Byron. Super nice. Uh, so yeah, don't mind. The it I got to fix that. I'm gonna pick a uh, mix, mix a fix in that. And um, uh, one moment, you guys. Make sure you get all the good. So I have a pair of Jordan Peele us uh, scissors. Since it's not that much merch out there, and I love this film, so I grabbed the scissors. Comment down below if you find any us merch. I will want to get that. But I have a Fright Night autograph. Evil Ed autographed it. Super cool guy, man. Um, and then I have a few NECA over there. I have the ghost face, claw figure. Um, let me see. I have the ghost face, claw figure, and I have Candyman, and I have Chucky, and I have like my box for my thriller set, my thriller um, 1 6 figure. I have a, 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 a freaking Valak. This is right here. It's a Valak statue. It's it's okay. Uh, this is the box for my Sideshow Myers. And this is something I picked up at uh, Spirit. It's a wall hanger of Slim from Killer Clowns. Super nice. This is the Killer Clowns rug from Spirit. I have the Killer Clowns plaque from Spirit. And you guys can see I have that Killer Clowns rug back there. And of course, you guys went crazy over him. You guys know I have Shorty, the animatronic. Me and Monica worked so hard to get him, but he looks so nice in the collection. And I love Shorty, man. You gotta love Killer Clowns, you guys. 
have a it chapter two movie poster super nice and um up here we have the Klaus 2018 figure uh Beetlejuice statue from spirit a little magnet a picture magnet from spirit my first NECA figure ever 2018 Mars a movie cup from where I'm with to go see um it and we have a ton of NECA I don't want to get all the way to it because we'll be here all day but I don't want to have acid either so we can talk about a little NECA as you see I have every Myers NECA Jamie Lee the bride of Chucky two-pack the 18 inch nightmare on Elm Street uh two I have the shorty mask from um spirit I have a creep show comic book with the creep up there ghost face mask Elm Street sign super sick man this is I love NECA but I'm starting to grow out of it but I also feel that you cannot ever just get rid of NECA man NECA is the OG as you see like I said it's all stacked have the part seven Jason um, the new blood um I have my kills I want a steel book right here. Gotta have that kill steel book, of course. Um, Leprechaun DVD. Tiny from Killer Clowns from a mock time super rare figure. Um, another Jason back there. I want to say it's from the final chapter. Shout out to Aaron, bro. I took that is a nice figure. Um, I have a nightmare on Elm Street. NECA back there, MDS, Mini Myers, Gremlins, The Scream Guy, pretty sure I have other shit stacked back there. Man, um, bro, it's just, you know, all my little things. I got a lot of big stuff also. Kills Knife and um, 78 Lamps and Knife Trick or Treat Studios, of course. And let's get to the Detolfs. My favorite part, first Detolf. We have the Thriller Michael Jackson. You guys, I love Thriller. Was raised on it. Had to get this piece. Went all out with it. Diorama and all. Got the newspapers blowing. The Thriller, I mean, the Thriller album by the Garbage. Super detailed figure. I highly recommend this. MJ. Thriller. Straight classic. Another hot, and this is about Hot Toys. Um, another Hot Toys we have, of course. The just now released Pennywise Hot Toys. Don't sleep on it, man. It is a must have, you guys. The presence on this is sick. And um, yeah, man, I love it, I love it, I love it. I can't say it more. Um, I definitely recommend this guy. He comes with a lot of accessories. And um, he's probably one of my favorite in the collection. And then we have Oh, my puck light went out. We have the Jason and Freddy sideshow from, um, I got, I'll do you guys one better. I'm not go half ass, I have to change the batteries. But, yep, Jason and Freddy sideshow 1-6. These were so slept on, I love them. Highly detailed. Look at that blood work on that knife. Freddy. If you guys slept on them, I recommend you guys. That, but yeah, they definitely bring together the collection. Recommend those highly. And then you guys, we have Clarence Williams and the Voodoo Doll from Tales from the Hood. Movie that I grew up on, super creepy. I'm honored to have these pieces in my collection by DWN Studios. They are sick. If you're a Tales from the Hood fan, I recommend you guys try to pick them up. But I think he's only doing a run of these. I want to say but super nice pieces as the first detolf we're getting somewhere you guys bear with me and you guys we have my life-size Myers one of the biggest pieces in my collection I'm so proud of I love this piece this piece holds so much of a presence all you guys talk about it all the time when you see them in the videos ask how i did it comment it's going to only get better because you guys just found out i will be doing a update on this guy to make him even more better 
comment down below if you want to see a video on that but let's get back to the tour um make a long story short my first life size first rehaul so he can get better put a bullet hole where jamie lee shot him trick-or-treat studios coveralls not much but he came out perfect 2018 myers poster behind him gotta have that to complete it Christopher Nelson's Officer Francis head, gifted to me by my boy T. Rob. Have the 78 pumpkin down there, lights up, and plays music. Has Meyer standing on those leaves. Classic. Missy Georgie picture. I got both of these from Days of the Dead. This guy always sells them. I think they're very cool. And a Wanted Myers autograph from Scout Taylor Compton. I love her so much. Hopefully I can meet her again. Definitely. Um, Tyler May autograph. Super sick. Now I actually made this shadow box. It's from Halloween 4 when she stabbed her um, I want to say her God, no, it was her foster parent. She stabbed her in the tub with those scissors. I made this. Made them all bloody. Movie accurate scissors. Blood on the mask. Decal right there. Um, a deep shadow box comment down below if you guys would like to make one i'll tell you guys how to do it and right under danielle harris of course um she definitely signed it, it was awesome meeting her shout it out to channel danielle you rock i love the podcast definitely man you gotta love danielle harris um 2018 18 inch myers super nice i actually have two of those but we'll get to that i have to have one unboxed and one boxed but um, I will be doing some modifications in this guy soon, speaking of him. So stay tuned for that. Lost Boys picture I got on vacation. Had to get that. It's like a little movie detail picture thing. Um, Halloween 4 mask. People sleep on Halloween 4. I love it. It's one of my favorite Halloweens. But I do hate the mask. But I had to have a piece of this in the collection because it's mandatory. If you get what I'm saying, Halloween fans. I have a, my guy Terry actually got me this ghost face plushie. Don't sleep on a plushie, man. It definitely is nice. I don't know about the other ones, but the ghost face one is sick. This is an attempt at 78 rehaul I did, which I think is not good. Don't pay attention to that because your boy has been working. I'm going to give it another shot. So stay tuned for that. This is a Spirit of Halloween motion sensor for Annabelle. It went out, but it's actually creepy as hell, you guys. Uh, this right here this is annabelle i've had her since i started collecting um i had to get her she was my first big piece that i purchased um from tots i love her um she will actually not be in a box much longer i'm getting a case for her and um she will be up here with this guy somewhere probably get a warm museum sign behind her light rocking chair I'm going to go all out for her, man, because I love the Conjuring series. Trick or Treat Studios killed that right there. Guys, definitely pick up that Annabelle 101 replica. Super cool. Okay. So we have right here, fun fact. You guys know I'm a rehaul artist. This is my personal copy. I have not touched it because I've been going hard on orders, but this guy will be getting touched in the next few weeks. I need me... A personal kills man i did everyone else's butt mines but we will get to that in the future um you guys i have the michael myers house um from spirit exclusive um had to get it fun fact that's the wrong address it's from a guy who actually made a replica of the house but i still like it I have the Halloween three season, the witch neck of figure three pack. Can't wait to get the trick or treat studios one six. Have a film magazine from Halloween kills. I have that statue that people were going ape shit over when it first released from spirit. Super nice. Can't take it away from spirit. Them giving us this awesome statue. Um, I have another Daniel Harris autograph. Like I told you guys, I love Danielle. Have to love her. I have a knocker from Halloween 2018. Super little nice Halloween, um, you know, add on. And again, I have a box 2018 that one day I might get signed. I just have to have two 
just for me because I love this that much. I think it's only one of it's only the only thing in my collection I have two of. So, but yeah, you guys, you got to have a freaking 2018. Um, fun fact, man, Matt Terrifier. He's actually my new favorite clown. Um, I actually think the Terrifier Art the clown. He's better than Pennywise. He's super creepy. I'm um, got to meet him. He is David Howard Thornton is a character, man. I love him. He's super cool. Um, for sure. That is when me and Monica met him. As like I said, he's a character. He made every minute worth it. Definitely recommend meeting him, man. Super cool. Tony Todd, the candy man, probably can't see him because the picture is very dark, but got to meet the candy man, the one and only. Super cool. Stranger Things poster that I have, which might come down because it's kind of tacky, no frame. I hate that. This is when I first started collecting. Don't judge me, but still my favorite show. L, of course, Millie Bobby Brown from Stranger Things. I wanted poster from the same guy with the Georgie and the Myers. We're going to get back to this wall, but I'm going to another detox. You guys are going to love this. <clears throat> we have the 78 shelf. Shelf, you heard me. First off, we have the Trick or Treat Studios. Um, Myers, Let me turn that lighting down for y'all. Yeah, the Myers, I like it with the orange light. Um, super nice, man. Trick or Treat Studios killed this. Uh, got the pumpkin accessory pack with the, with the foam sitting right there with the leaves. Got this from Diabolical Designs that stand. Judith Myerstone. This actually came with the knife. This little picture back here. This knife I got from you. Oh, I said YouTube, eBay. I forgot the guy's name, man. I always, bro. I forgot his name. He's on eBay. He's actually sold doing this for twenty dollars. Um, definitely, and it's real metal knife. Fun fact. I've made this actually myself. I printed it and put it in a little sleeve. <laughs> so that's cool. Bob Sheep Sideshow ultimate bob sheet man sorry to say trick or treat sideshow killed you guys with the bob man and the guy this is another one of his knives like you see it's real metal you guys I'm trying to let it focus that's a real metal knife that glare and he actually came this these newspapers actually came with the knife that mini Lori picture, I love that man. This is, oh my God, I love that. He killed it with that. And more newspapers, but yeah, you guys, that's that 78 shelf you guys always are asking about. Oh my God, let me see your 78 uh, setup. Here you go, you guys. I love this shelf. Going down, you guys, we have the Halloween, the Halloween five and four. Once again, Trick or Treat Studios killed it with these. I love them. A lot of people, you know, judge them and say they don't like them, but I'm a Myers fan, man. I know, like, if you, you know, it don't mean anything. I just, I love everything Michael Myers. I'm sorry, you guys. But, um, I have literally every 1-6 Myers that came out licensed. And, um, I only plan to get every last one of them they come out with. Uh, they dropped Halloween 6, Halloween 2, H2O, Resurrection, Illumis. I'm getting every one, you guys. Don't worry, you will see reviews of those on the channel. And hopefully get a Rob Zombie line, because I will love to get Rob Zombie. It will be the ultimate Myers collection, um, for sure. <clears throat> 2018, you guys. Trick or Treat Studios, Myers, super nice. Everyone already knows about this. Love this figure. This is probably one of my favorite 1-6 Myers-wise, for sure, between this and the 78. I have a head knocker, a little nice, you know, head knocker. And you guys, these VHSs are from Away Teams Customs. Awesome guy, man. I can't believe he did a kills already. Um, but this right here, I love the cover for that. And fun fact, you guys, this actually plays the movie. He killed it with this shit. Um, Sideshow Pumpkin. Eh, sorry. My boy. Ryan fucking Harper, man, his head sculpt is the best in the game. I already tell you guys, he's killing it with the Meyer sculpt. No one has a but a better sculpt 
than him. Check out my video um, on this. No one's fucking with my guy, man. Definitely. Um, Kills figure coming soon. Been super busy. <laughs> Judith Meyer sideshow back there. Super nice. Um, I actually love the weathering on that. And if you guys can see behind, that is a vinyl from uh, Sacred Bones, the Kill soundtracks. Super freaking nice, you guys. I love this detail. One of my favorite details, man. Down here, I'm not going to get too, you know, basically in depth, but Halloween 2 NECA pack, Loomis and Lori, Halloween 2 NECA, Myers, Halloween 2 Claw, Claw figure, autographed by Tony Warren. Yeah, you know, sorry. But I have the Rob Zombie Tyler Main, Myers, autographed by him. As you can see, his autograph is kind of plain. And then I have. Let me see if I can show you. I have more back there. I have like this is the stuff you guys don't see. Like I have this, the Rob Zombie Halloween 2 um, NECA. I have one that's in the auction on eBay. Super nice. This is the. I actually like this just because of it's a little nostalgia. Got the poster still in good shape. That's kind of rare. Here's our Tony Moran autograph. And this was before all the confusion. And yeah, but I plan on getting another one of these plain. Just, you know. So, you guys, this is the little light side of my room. Um, 2018 Mini Myers movie poster. Tales from the Hood movie poster. Got this from Horror Hound this year. I mean, last year. 13 Ghost movie poster. Love 13 Ghost. Man, Trick or Treat Studios. Somebody out there, please, please do a 13 Ghost something. Mass figure something. This fucking film is so underrated. Please do it, you guys. Comment down below, you guys, if you would like to see some 13 Ghost stuff, man. The chat cool. Oh my god. Comment down below, you guys, and just. Man, I need some 13 ghosts in my collection for sure. But those photo ops, that's the one and only Tony Todd for me and the wife. That's me and Lisa Shea from Insidious. If you guys don't know who that is, I'm pretty sure if you're a horror fan, you definitely know Lisa Shea. These are at my first con, by the way. That is Bonnie Aarons, Valak, my favorite horror female villain of all time. Um, me and um, of course Danielle Harris she's super cool me and Scout gotta have them next to each other like best friends um, me and Tyler Main with the wife super cool and me and Tony Moran I don't know how I feel about him you guys after what I heard uh, at the end of the day I was supporting Halloween people I mean, not people, not people, cast, um, actors and stuff like that. And then I came across that rumor and stuff. So now it's like, cause I'm a Halloween fan. I'm not going to get too much into, <coughs> into it, but you know what I mean. And this is my little extras desk. You know, not desk, but I just sit stuff like this over here until I get stuff, you know, situated. But this all will be moved soon. I'm actually still in the... <sighs> Uh, just mo moving stuff I'm like just still trying to figure out where stuff's gonna go but this is a 2018 stock that I will be rehauling soon for me myself that's a Myers hat that um I've obtained uh, at a con uh, and I'm, I, I said at a con no actually someone uh, gave me this um, got me this for a gift as a gift and it was super cool I never seen this hat but uh yeah um, Monica's one of her aunts gave me a Stephen King book because you know I collect horror and um, I love that um, book. <coughs> One moment. Sorry for coughing. Throat's a little dry, but I love Stephen King, so it's super nice. Uh, I don't want to knock a lot. So, yeah, you guys, these are autographs and photo ops I haven't put up yet. This is when I met Christopher Nelson. One of the best moments of my life. Uh, this is when he told me he watches the channel. 
me and the shape, original shape, Nick Castle with the wife. Um, hurry up and skim through these. This is when I met the shape when he autographed me. And I love this. This is probably one of the best autographs of my life. Uh, my guy, Sean Clark, man, I love. Thing with two heads, man. He's a super cool guy. He is down to earth. I love Sean Clark. Keep up the great work, bro. Um, me, James, Drew, Courtney. Man, tch, looking at these pictures just bring back so many good memories. Can't wait to hang those up. I'm trying to get through this. Uh, my favorite YouTubers of all time, of course. Two, we like scary. <laughs> You guys, I love them. These are my favorite YouTubers. Grim Life Collective. It was a dream meeting. I got to talk to them, man. Oh my God. The motivation these guys gave me guys gave me is incredible. Um, I get to see these guys again. They come back to Cincinnati. Man, I just love Grim Life, man. I feel like I know them like they're my friends or some. Um, that day we met, it was incredible, man. Keep up the great work, Grim Life. You guys play a big motivation. Um just y'all you guys play a big part of my life motivation wise and like just keeping me going with the uh channel man you guys definitely do man i love my life this is a horror nights pamphlet when i went to horror nights uh this is when i met linda pj souls from the original 78 super cool man love pj Souls. she's very laid back Autograph from the thing with two heads. Can't wait to fucking hang this up. My favorite podcast. And we have Sandy Johnson from a famous scene in 78. Judith Myers autograph. She is very cool too. She actually follows me on a few social medias. Um, yeah, Sandy Johnson is very cool. And this is the legend, none other than Robert England. Uh, I love Robert Anglin, man. He's super cool. Nightmare on Elm Street. You gotta respect this guy, man. Him right here. He is awesome. But I'm not gonna lie. His lines are fucking insane. And, um, all I'm gonna say is, if you guys don't do cons, and, um, you think it's a cakewalk getting autographed from him, it is not. Just letting you guys know before you think it's cakewalk. Um... This is oh, some artwork I got from a con. I forgot the guy's name, but he is a beast. Um, Kills artwork, of course. Um, Stranger Things figure back there. Now, this is where I'm going to get kind of, ah, because I have stuff stacked. This is a Kills poster you can see. That's autographed by James Drew Courtney. I have not put up yet. Funkos from Us. Once again, comment, you guys, if you find any Us merch. I would love to get my hands on that stranger things ghostbuster pack any cobra kai fans this is my only non horror item and because i'm a big karate kid fan so i had that <clears throat> trying to, i have a lost boys neca david right there some of this stuff you guys i can't move because i just don't want to feel like rearranging it you guys get it though freddy I mean robert gave me this once he autographed my stuff but as you see what I have back here, I can actually show you guys like the names of what I got. So I have the It Chapter 2 NECA, Halloween Kills, Freddy vs. Jason NECA, Gremlins. I think that's Stripe actually. I have Sam Trick or Treat, uh, 2009 Jason, Annabelle. Every fucking Stranger Things figure you could think of, of course. And um, I have, these are from I forgot the name of this fucking line, but I have Candyman, Jeepers Creepers, and Reagan from Us. And then I have, I'm not from Us, from Actresses, what the hell. And then I have um, some more Us Funkos, a couple VHSs, Scare Fresheners, Nightmare Toys, one of my favorite stores. And, um, it's some stuff back here, but it's more, um, Actually, it's more uh, Stranger Things stuff, so yeah, let me put that right there. But this is a Nightmare on Elm Street poster that I cannot wait to put up. It is sick, you guys. I promise. Like I said, I still have stuff I have to do um, with my collection. It's just, it, I have to take time, man, because you know I'm only literally one person. So, 
And then we have my Lost Boys poster. You gotta love Lost Boys. One of my favorite. This is my favorite um, vampire movie, but it's one of my favorite horror movies. So, Lost Boys, of course. Beetlejuice, of course. Um, the original poster <clears throat> with the Beetlejuice tombstone that lights up that I got from Spirit. Love that, man. Super nice add-on to have under the damn poster. Losers Club plaque. Uh, I got from Spirit, same as the Hand and Field. A Chucky 2 mini movie poster with a Halloween Rob Zombie uh, poster. Um, like I said, I got a lot of stuff to fix. Stuff are kind of crooked. Stuff is kind of crooked. And um, I just haven't been able to fix stuff, but it will be coming. I'm um, so on me fixing stuff. But uh, this is from Byron Winton. This is actually my favorite piece he's done. Halloween 78. I have Lori, Lindsay, and Tommy Doyle with Myers in the back. I wish he did these a little bigger. I, mean, I would have this big as hell in my collection. But we have my guy, Stephen LaRose. Again, like I said, I'm trying my best to keep up with his art pieces. That I um, his, All his art is crazy, but I'm, his Myers is, is, oh my God. As you see, I have the for you. Keep up the great work, Steven. Um, from Byron Wayne, of course. Have Nancy and Freddie. Have some type of Pennywise book I had got a while back. Uh, this is the stuff you guys don't see, like the 112 Mazco Myers um, unopened. And uh, back here is like a little Myers picture, a little, a little plaque thing. I have Goosebumps, the original VHS, the Hunted Mask, with the Hunted 2. Um, book that I will be in that mask on. I have this mask from Longshore, the Goosebumps Hunted Mask, my favorite show growing up. Um, I still love Goosebumps. This is my favorite um, episode. I, um, actually, uh, Pennywise statue from um, from Spirit. Uh, Freddy Krueger. Um, I want to say it's. Oh, I forgot which nine row Elm Street it's just from, but uh, my second mom got me that for Christmas. I love this mask, super cool. Wish they would have made the eye cuts a little smaller, just so I can have some fun with it. You know what I mean? I uh, got the Goosebumps original hunting mask book. Uh, we have the Talking Child's Play 2 um, uh, doll from, uh, I think it's Mads Co., I want to say, or MDS, I forgot have a kill standing up. I have two kills. I have this just standing out. I open. This is actually from MDS, I want to say. This is nice. It talks. Stuff like that. Whorehound Loomis. I said Loomis. I mean Whorehound Kills um, book that I had got. Super nice. Has a lot of kills content in there. Has an have another kill 7 inch. 18 inch. One of the grills in the collection that I love. 18 inch Rob Zombie Myers that my guy got me for my birthday. My guy Juice, uh, I can't believe I still can't believe it. It's in great condition. I, I it's not in the best, but it's in great for it to be that old. So I love this. Um, back here, you see, I have the good guy cereal. Um, I actually tried that on the channel. If you guys want to check that out, Chucky Head Knocker autograph from Alex Vincent Andy. This was so crazy, me and him, once again. Uh, this is one of my first, when I first started collecting. I have a Robert England when I went to the Horror Hounds. He autographed my Nightmare on Elm Street Glove. Still trying to figure out how I'm gonna display that. Appreciate that, Robert England, man. Absolute legend. Um, I have another one of those Talking Chuckies from Chucky 3. This is the piece of face, you guys. This is the piece of face Chucky. Um, and this is one of the first ones I got. I actually got this on vacation. I'm like, I have to get this. This shit was cool, just off the fact that he was talking. Um, yeah, just off the fact he talked. This is when I got introduced to the piece of face Chucky. I had got him. Um, have Art the Clown up there. Super nice. Uh, life size coming soon for sure. I gotta have a life size Art because he's so damn creepy, and he creeps me out. So. And 
we have a poster my guy Terry got me with all the horror villains like they're sitting at the table the 12 disciples looking table have a Condren poster behind my first life-size creation um, actually Valak the Nun uh, super nice I love her look how creepy she is even with direct light on her the Nun man super nice this is a pillow I got from the flea market it's a Halloween too Jamie Lee, Myers, Loomis, super nice. I just put that under her just to, but yeah, this mask is by Nightmare Effects. Man, that guy, he's talented, man. I, he definitely needs to start back doing work. I don't think he does work anymore, but he is so goddamn talented. Um, so I have another pillow. It's a Pennywise pillow from that flea market stacked on a fucking, probably a hundred Fangoria magazines that, uh, no lie, monica um uncle gave to me as a gift because he's not into like collecting anymore man it's going to be a long time before i get to read all of those thanks again to you man i want to say his name super super grateful for those man honestly um we're at the last detail you guys this video feels so damn long um we're at the last detail um so of course let me open this. I want to give you guys a great. We have one of my favorite pieces in the collection. My Seed of Chucky doll from Trick or Treat Studios. I definitely recommend you guys to get one of these. Because, God damn, man. Look at that. It looks like it came out the damn movie screen. And back here, if you see those pictures of the Bleeding Tears Myers and like the Nun. I got those from Makai. He does like hand paints. Super cool. I have the amulet from Seed of Chucky to sit right under him with the movie. I will be getting Glenn and Tiffany very soon. Uh, just know those things are not are not cheap, but they're coming. I already are in the works. <clears throat> and a new piece that I've got this year from Jamie Grove, the freaking Rob Zombie Myers mask. This is the Rob Zombie Myers knife from back in the day with the, from Spirit when the costume came out with the unrated extended, I mean, yeah, the director's cut. Look at that, man. Even in natural light, sick ass mask. Gotta have one of those, you guys. Myers fans, you gotta have one of these. So sick. Then I have the 916. I love her. I had to get her, man, because it's not too much conjuring stuff out there. Had to grab her and have to have Annabelle next to her, of course. Um, I actually made that dog case. It's a candle holder. Put the sign up there with the devil card, with the rocket chair. It um, came out nice. <laughs> We're on to the last and final deeds off, you guys. So this is my PCS. You guys are definitely familiar with this. Uh, this is one of my most expensive pieces. This is the PCS Myers statue that people slept on that was so damn sick. Um, what can I say, man? This shit still, my looks at it, it gives me the chills. The presence it holds is crazy. But um, back there I have the collector's edition Halloween. 78 this is a judith meyer stones from spirit another one of those um newspapers from the guy for guy's fucking name man i'm not going to keep saying that though have a 78 head knocker and down here we have art the clown from um trick-or-treat studios you gotta get an Art the Clown one, see, because I don't know what else to say. Like, it's nothing out there for him, for real. You have to get one. Um, I'm actually gonna get either a regular one and do it bloody, or get a bloody one and just, you know, I gotta have both. So, coming soon. Look at that, man. Fucking incredible. Fucking incredible. And the final shelf. We have Mr. Ghostface. From Sideshow. I think this guy is sold out right now. I'm so happy I pulled the trigger on his ghost face because 
He's he's lovely. Fuck nice. He's lovely. I love this ghost face. He's sick. Just look at him. Have the head knocker next to him. I think that's cool. And yeah, you guys, one more look at that. Yeah, you guys, man. I gave you guys the freaking horror tour 2022. So as you've seen the growth, you guys, um, oh my God, just doing this video, just, I remember I started off with one NECA figure. Forget three and two. I started off with one from FYE, the 2018 um, Myers NECA. And um, this is just proof, you guys, I'm not gonna get too deep into it, but this is just proof, you guys, you can start with anything and, and just get as big as the, my collection you guys um i know a lot of you guys always say oh my god brandon your collection is incredible it grew so fast you guys can do the same thing man just stay committed and you gotta want your collection to grow you gotta you gotta put in the effort and want better for your collection you know what i'm saying if that makes sense um it doesn't come overnight that's another thing you cannot rush this it does it's come over time um my collection is my life and that's another thing collect for yourself man don't collect for just oh my god what's trending everything in my collection i love i love you guys it's my it's my it might be a little few knickknacks that i'm like ah. i'm talking stuff this i love i love i love everything in my i set it up the way that i set it up because i love the way it looks i do this for you know my collection is this is what i come into every day and look and take a deep breath and just this is my happy place you guys um you guys can do it out there. All you guys always inbox me. Look what I got, Brandon. I got this neck of seven inch. I got this freaking Sideshow 1-6. Keep going, you guys. You will be able to achieve this, man, if you believe in yourself and just want better for your collection. It doesn't come overnight. It doesn't come overnight, you guys. But I promise you, I promise you, you guys, you will get there. I promise you, man. You heard it from Brandon, from I Like Scare, you guys. I love you guys, man. You guys are just incredible, man. I would not have any of this, any of this, you guys. I won't have without you. And I mean that. You guys push me so much. Fright Night Fridays. Uh, me just posting. Me staying up all night. Right now, I bullshit you not, you guys. It is 1226 at night. And I'm recording. I bullshit you not, you guys. I love you guys, man. I do this. This is my pet. I've loved horror my whole life. And I'm so happy I can share it with people across the world. You guys are my friends. You guys support me. Subscribers. You make the channel. I don't make the channel. You guys make the channel. You guys tell me what you guys want to see. I love you guys, man. Don't, don't ever think for once that I, you know, that I don't try to look at these messages i try to, to reply back to each and every one of you guys you guys definitely mean the world to me man i mean that um that's why i do fright nights to talk to you guys one-on-one -on -one and stuff like that but um yeah you guys man i did this for you guys this video will be up very soon i have to edit it and stuff like that but um you guys it's 2022 this is only the beginning this is only the beginning we have more stuff to put in this damn room <laughs> more filming locations, more cons, meeting more celebrities. We're achieving more memories, more milestones. We're getting there. I like scary. They're gonna know who we are. They're gonna know how far we came. They're gonna know how much we love this horror stuff, you guys. I promise you guys that. It's your boy Brandon from I Like Scary, you guys. And uh, watch some horror movies. <laughs> Look up stuff to put in your collection because that's what I'm gonna do. Um, watch some YouTube, that's what I do. And um, yeah, you guys, man, I appreciate you guys from the bottom of my heart. It's Brandon from I Like Scary, you guys. Don't forget to slash that like button. Hit me, hit me up on my social medias. You know, we're out. Peace.